It was a win-loss situation for two Niswa breweries as the city council voted on the future of Sunday growler sales. Big Axe walked away with the victory as the council approved three, three breweries under their ordinance, but Goldam was not. The ordinance passed allows Big Axe to apply for the license to sell growlers on Sunday, paying an annual fee of $100 after the ordinance is published in the local paper. The motion plans to be published in the paper the 28th of this month, allowing Big Axe to start the sale of growlers Sunday, July 31st. The council really did us a favor here, allowing first amending it and then expediting the fact that we could get this done and still save August. Um, so I, at first there was questions about if we could even do it that quickly, first amendment, then you have to approve the license and uh, they, were, they were saying it had to be separate meetings or Anyway, we were really happy they could do this so quickly. So this is awesome. We get to save like the last um, good month of the summer vacation. Goldam was not approved due to a violation of Sunday growler sales where the business sold t-shirts in exchange for a free growler on Sundays. The city council plans to enforce some sort of punishment in regards to this violation after they meet with owners of Goldam in a public hearing setting. Goldam owners and managers denied to comment on the issue following the decision. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.